The Citizenship by Investment Program was started by the new National Party Administration in August of 2013. It requires applicants to either make a significant economic contribution to the country or to acquire a government-approved qualifying asset. During the 2022 budget delivery, Finance Minister Gregory Boeing said government collection of total receipts under the CBI program as of October 31st was $30.6 million. US dollars. At the NNP rally held at Pearls on Sunday, Dr. Mitchell said there cannot be any perceived conflict of interest as it relates to the CBI program. We declare tonight that the CBI program must be run and managed with no inherent conflict by people who oversee that program. And with no loyalty, and the only loyalty to is to the people of Grenada, Karakou, and Pity Martinique. This cash yielding initiative is one that Dr. Mitchell wants to guard against, who is put in control. There are those who have their friends who believe they want to control this country of ours. We are welcoming people to all and sundry, but you must come here and respect the people of this land. Who want to sell out this country will not come through the new National Party. Candidate for the new National Party St. John's constituency, Alvin Dabrio, already has plans for the CBI program to be utilized to develop the constituency if re-elected into office. That the CBI program should not only be for the hotel belt. I know my brother in St. David is getting two five-star hotel. So, now, not, well, that's not what we want. What we want, and you would see happening, we already get approval from cabinet to tweak the CBI program so we could spend some money in St. John's and St. Mark's for smart agriculture and for fish processing, brothers and sisters. When Deacon Mitchell, a corporate lawyer by profession, stepped into the political ring and subsequently became the political leader of the National Democratic Congress, he already held the view that funds generated by the CBI can be used in the transformation of Grenada. On June 23rd, Grenadians will go to the polls and will elect one Mitchell to take Grenada forward. Cherry and Blackman Stephen, GBN News.